Ready? Hey, so we're on a northeast facing slope at about 9,200 feet in Big Cottonwood Canyon today. Low angle meadow skipping. We're walking on an 18 degree slope, making sure that we give all of this bigger north facing terrain above us a really wide berth. We're not getting in the avalanche path, and surfing the lower angle meadows. On our second lap on the skin track coming up, we got a thundering collapse in the snowpack, shooting cracks off from my skis. Had I tilted the slope angle up to 30, 35 degrees, an avalanche train, we found an avalanche. What this is telling me is that three to four days after a big storm, a big load on this persistent weak layer, we are still getting thundering collapses. I pulled out my shovel, I dug down to the ground, I have a height of snow of 70 centimeters here, so pretty thin. As I'm isolating my extended column tests, I got failure upon isolation. Okay, and so I have a little bit of a wind crust on top. Down below, I have some powder snow. And then here, right above the weak layer, I have a pretty stiff one finger slab resting on very, very weak faceted snow grains. This problem is not going anywhere soon, especially as we start to add more of a load, more snow on top of this over the next seven to 10 days, things are gonna become very, very touchy in our mountains here in, central, in the central Wasatch.